Good morning, trucking junkies. We are uh, done unloading here at the Lowe's in Bedford. Is that where it's at? Not Bedford. Is it Bedford? It is Bedford. Holy crap. Bedford, Indiana. And we have a job. We're headed to uh, Jeffersonville, Indiana to pick up some coils and maybe this time people won't cut in front of me we'll see and that's going to Pennsylvania for tomorrow woohoo uh, two different kind of coils though I'm getting two uh, roll coil and racks and then three stand up coils Stinking awesome. Oh. Let's see if we can get to Jeffersonville. Let's go. We're here. Oh, we gotta back up into door number four over here. We're getting two lay down coils and three stand up coils. Uh more work it's all right I guess we'll get in and out back her on up Jeremy I like their doors nice and wide. Back right on in. Check it out, they got their pull through open. Yay!
I'm gonna tell you, this is the first time I've been back here. Yep. This dude just parked right there. He ain't here. I'm gonna go back around to the front. Alright, so there's what we're hauling. Had to have him move this one up a little bit or back a little bit. He had it like way up here. The closer you can get these together without damaging them, the better. See how much gap he's got in there? He could have moved that one up a little bit more too. But it's alright, they'll ride. I'm gonna do some securement and then I'm gonna show you the tarpon. Somebody in my comment section said that they couldn't get their stand-up coils to tarp right. So I'm gonna show you the way to do it. It's very easy. I'm gonna go to work. So now that we're all secured up and I've had a visit from safety, uh, yeah, that's right. Maverick has roaming safety people that come by and make sure you're doing everything correctly at some of these places. I've been doing this for two years. That's the first time I've ever seen one. <laughs> But he didn't have any problem with the stuff I was doing. So integrity is what you do when you're not being watched. Right? So whew, it's hot. First thing you do with every top job is you button down every corner. All four corners, right? Making a wall. See there? <clears throat> the next thing you do is you're gonna hook one of the middle eye uh, D-rings on one side. Take that, flap that under. And you're gonna pull this tight. Now what that does is that keeps this side from pulling on that side when you're doing all your, all your bungees on that side. So let's go to the other side. All right, next step, I hang all my, all my straps or all my uh, bungees on this side, on one side. This one I'm gonna leave off because I'm gonna do that one along with my front. So I'm gonna start with this one, right? And I'm gonna take this, just like the other side, I'm gonna flip it up. I'm gonna tack that down right there, see? And I'm going to push that, pull that over here. That keeps all of this down. And I just work my way down the, down the row. That took about two minutes. All that. Now we go to the other side and do the same thing. All right. Both sides are done now. Now we're going to take off the corners. All four of them. Let that droop. Okay, so front and backs are done the same on every single steel load that I do, okay? Every one of them. It's hot. So I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna flip this up and in, okay? I'm gonna take this, I'm gonna cinch it down right here. Okay, I'm gonna take this inside one. I'm just like this. See how I shove that in there? I may need another one out here. I'm gonna need one more. Maybe. No. I think I can do it this way. Here we go. This is going to come here. And back.
I'm gonna grab that same D-ring, the other side. I'm gonna flip this back. I'm gonna grab this D-ring right here. All this is gonna get folded up in there. I'm gonna grab that D-ring. I'm gonna come in here, cinch it down. All that's going in there. I'm gonna grab this D-ring. It's the same, it's the same strip as the one I just did. And I'm gonna take that and I'm gonna pull it. Pull it straight down. Hook it in. And I'm gonna go to the other side and do the same. Now I can, I can grab another D-ring here if I, I'll show you. I grab that one right there, flip around. There we go. If I grab that one, I can pull it here. Just a little bit extra security, a little bit extra pull on that. I'm gonna grab this D-ring. All this goes under there. I'm gonna grab that one and pull this one straight out. Hook it in. I think I'm gonna leave that other D-ring the way it is. That's my back. Fronts are done the same way. And there she is. Let's go.